Greetings and welcome back to Herbalist Notebook, Herbal Aficionados. Today, as we explore the amazing history of herbal therapy, we're going on an engrossing voyage through time. I'm excited to share with you the intricate story of how plants have influenced many countries' traditional medical practices. This film will help you comprehend the significant influence of herbal remedies on our worldwide legacy, as well as the history of past civilizations and the knowledge of influential herbalists. So take a seat back, unwind, and let's start this exciting journey through the world of herbs together. Using plants and their extracts to improve health and treat illnesses is the fundamental component of herbal therapy. It's an ancient ritual with strong roots in many different civilizations. Imagine a period when the abundance of nature served as a source of healing for ancient societies such as the Chinese, Indians, Greeks, and Romans. These civilizations realized the amazing potential of herbs appreciating their therapeutic qualities and utilizing them in their everyday routines. We will thus examine how these ancient societies utilize the health-promoting properties of herbs as we go through time. Ancient Civilization As we go deeper into ancient cultures, we find that their usage of herbs is central to their pursuit of health. Imagine Hippocrates or other Greek doctors giving herbs for treatment or imagine ancient Chinese herbalists painstakingly creating concoctions. Ayurvedic practitioners in India treated plants as sacred treasures. For their own health, Romans also embraced the world of plants. Envision the verdant gardens of these societies, abundant in therapeutic herbs. Let's use images to help visualize this journey. Historical artwork showing herbalists at work, maps showing the trading routes of valuable herbs, and old scrolls revealing herbal expertise. These historical tidbits vividly depict the many ways that herbs were valued and used in many cultures. Let us now introduce you to the major players who influenced the herbal world. Greek physician Dioscorides wrote Demateria Medica, a seminal herbal encyclopedia. Imagine Hippocrates, who is regarded as the father of medicine, teaching Greek physicians about herbs. These individuals passed on their expertise to succeeding generations, laying the groundwork for herbalism. Come along on a historical voyage through the pages of manuscripts from herbalists who carved their wisdom into scrolls, Hippocrates' medical treatises, and Dioscorides' meticulous records. These writings are more than simply words. They are historical windows that show the centuries-old herbal heritage. Traditional medicine systems. Let's now explore historical health customs. To balance life energy, traditional Chinese medicine, TCM in China, created special herbal mixtures. Consider Ayurveda in India, where the body and mind are harmonized with herbs. Both systems instruct us in the art of herbal wellness, much like old guides do. Imagine holistic practices that celebrate the treasures of nature and herbal teas steeping in peaceful places. These customs have endured through the ages, impacting contemporary medical procedures with their straightforward but effective herbal remedies. Middle Ages and Renaissance The Middle Ages expand with herbal wisdom nestled in monastic gardens as we travel across time. Herbs were cultivated with great care by monks, who preserved information like priceless manuscripts. Envision these serene gardens a sanctuary for medicinal plants. Let us now turn to the Renaissance, a period of renewed interest in herbs. Painters depict landscapes full of herbs, reflecting a resurgence of interest. Imagine the Renaissance, whereby traditional herbal books are revitalized. Herbal knowledge, formerly tucked away in hushed monastic corners, explodes in this era, ushering in a global botanical renaissance. Monastic gardens provided herbs with a peaceful haven during the Middle Ages, in the calm of the cloisters, monks conserved plant knowledge, much like herbal caretakers. Imagine these gardens as living, breathing herb libraries. Step forward to the Renaissance, a period marked by the resurgence of herbs. Herbal wisdom, formerly hidden, now takes the stage as science and art merge. Imagine a botanical Renaissance, 
a rebirth of ancient herbal literature long forgotten and tucked in the corners of monasteries, inspiring future generations. Herbalism in the Americas. Let us now pay tribute to Native Americans in the Americas and their rich herbal traditions. Imagine vast landscapes where tribes coexist peacefully with the medicinal plants of nature. Like herbal storytellers, Native American healers made use of indigenous plants for healing. Consider the varied patterns of healing that exist throughout the continent. These locally based customs serve as a reminder of the world's diverse body of herbal knowledge. The Earth's bounty in the Americas became a source of well-being, creating a colorful herbal story. Modern evolution. Let's now enter the contemporary period of herbal medicine. Think about a bridge that ties modern knowledge to ancient wisdom. Modern medication and traditional herbal knowledge go hand in hand, much like an everlasting guide. Imagine modern science and traditional treatments coexisting harmoniously. There is a resurgence of interest in herbal medicines in this era that is reminiscent of earlier times. Imagine a tapestry that weaves together traditional methods and cutting-edge knowledge to create a comprehensive approach to well-being in the modern world. Scientific validation. Let's now examine the current state of the herbal world. Imagine scientists investigating the potential for plant healing. Like contemporary storytellers, recent investigations confirm the efficacy of particular herbal treatment. Consider these studies as the keys to the advantages of herbs. Like a guiding light, scientific research reveals aspects of plant medicine that our ancestors may not have known about. Today's world brings together science and tradition to demonstrate a deeper respect for nature's age-old solutions. Conclusion. Let's take a moment to review the mosaic we've created as we come to the end of our exploration through the herbal annals. Herbs have been reliable allies on the road to health from prehistoric times to the present. Herbal medicine is still relevant today, as evidenced by research findings that support its effectiveness. The wisdom of the past in healing blends with contemporary comprehension to create a comprehensive approach to well-being. Let's acknowledge the enduring value of herbal medicine in our lives as we wrap up. Approach the study of herbal treatments with caution and interest. While our film is a helpful guide, while embarking on your herbal adventure, seek the advice of trained professionals as nature's medicine is wide.